Have you ever wondered how the sun affects Earth's climate? It's a fascinating interplay of energy and environment. The sun, our nearest star, showers the Earth with a constant stream of energy. This energy is the driving force behind our weather patterns and climate. However, not all parts of the Earth receive the same amount of solar energy. The Earth's rotation and tilt play significant roles here, resulting in different climate zones and seasons. In the past, periods of low sunspot activity, like the Maunder Minimum in the mid-17th century, have coincided with cooler global temperatures. The sun's intensity and brightness fluctuate, and these variations can have a significant impact, particularly in Earth's northern latitudes. Moreover, Serbian physicist Milutin Milankovic discovered that natural cycles in Earth's orbit influence climate shifts. These include changes in eccentricity, axial tilt, and axial precession. Ice core samples have shown a strong connection between these cycles and periods of glaciation and warming. Indeed, the sun plays a crucial role in shaping our climate, but how does this process exactly work? Let's delve deeper. To understand this relationship, we need to delve into the science behind it. Let's kick off with solar radiation. This is the sun's energy that reaches the Earth. Some of it is reflected back into space but a good chunk is absorbed by the Earth's surface. This heat is then re-emitted as infrared radiation. But here's the twist. Greenhouse gases in our atmosphere trap some of this infrared radiation, preventing it from escaping into space. This is known as the greenhouse effect, and it's crucial for keeping our planet warm enough to sustain life. Now let's talk about sunspots. These are cooler areas on the sun's surface that indicate high solar activity. During periods of high solar activity, the sun emits more radiation which can affect our climate. The Maunder Minimum, a period of low sunspot activity in the 17th century, coincided with the Little Ice Age, a time of cooler temperatures in Europe. Then we have the Milankovic cycles. Named after Serbian physicist Milutin Milankovic, these are natural cycles in Earth's orbit that influence climate shifts. They involve changes in eccentricity, axial tilt, and axial precession, which affect the amount and distribution of sunlight reaching the Earth. So you see variations in solar activity and Earth's orbital characteristics can significantly influence our climate. Let's recap the main points about how the sun affects Earth's climate. The intensity of sunlight, as indicated by sunspot activity, and natural cycles in Earth's orbit, known as Milankovic cycles, both play significant roles in our planet's climate. Flashback to the Maunder Minimum, a time in the 17th century when sunspot activity was at a low. This period coincided with the Little Ice Age, a time of cooler temperatures particularly in Europe. This illustrates the relationship between the sun's intensity and Earth's climate, especially in the northern latitudes. Fast forward to the 20th century, when Serbian physicist Milutin Milankovic discovered the natural cycles in Earth's orbit that influence climate shifts. These cycles include changes in eccentricity, axial tilt, and axial precession. Ice core samples have since confirmed a strong connection between these cycles and periods of glaciation and warming. However, the plot twist in our story is the current situation. According to Milankovic cycles, Earth should be experiencing a cooling period, but instead we're witnessing global warming. The culprit? Human carbon emissions that have overridden the sun's influence and upset the natural balance. So, while the sun is a key player in Earth's climate, our actions are now significantly influencing this delicate balance. Subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay in touch with the latest in science.